Hi, beautiful people. Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is your girl, Nosy Rosie, where I do reaction and commentary videos. We are gathered today for another reaction video. Remember, this video is for entertainment purposes only covered by fair use. Please be kind to everyone, everywhere, especially in the comment section. Please do not show hate to anybody. Okay, with that being said, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much. Let's get into it. Hey, beautiful people. This is your girl, Nosy Rosie, and I am back with another reaction video, okay? I hope that everyone is having a fantastic, wonderful, beautiful, amazing, productive day, okay? So anyway, um, I will be reacting on My Jazzy Life, okay, titled back to school hair shopping day in the life with seven kids all right y'all so here we go we moving on along we gonna move on to this overview okay so my jazzy life you know she did a shout out or whatnot okay we moving on past that right so basically uh she's in the kitchen and she's making some coffee making baby legendary some cereal and she makes her like some some little breakfast or whatnot it looked like a bagel with strawberry cream cheese okay all right so moving on oh excuse me y'all mm. I had a little cocktail. I, please excuse me. Blooper. All right, y'all. So moving on. So then um, she basically, she's in her little leopard robe or whatever. You know, like, grrr, you know what I mean? Something like that. She in her little leopard robe or whatever. And she's like, oh, my stomach hurts, everybody. Oh, and I'm so super tired. And I was like, mm, girl, okay. So anyway, so she's super tired in her little leopard robe. And she explains, you know, that she has like a box of clothes on to the side. And she says that people are saying that, you know, are saying or complaining about her getting like school clothes and school supplies from um, Philip's mother, uh, which is her ex's mother, which is the kid's grandmother. She's saying people are complaining about her, you know, getting school supplies and clothes and this that, and the other. And so then she goes on to say that she brought the kids clothes and school supplies. And she kind of seemed very irritated that the YouTube people, apparently YouTube, Instagram, I don't know. I'm just going to go ahead and say the people. The people were saying that she doesn't need any help and she shouldn't take help from, you know, the um, grandmother and this, that and the other. Right. So then she moves on and she says, OK, y'all, you know what? Um, I talked to my girl, Liv's life, and you know what? We were conversing back and forth, and you know, I want to do some new content. I want to do some new content. I want to be out and about. I'm tired of doing this same old stuff. You know, I want to like, you know, like travel, do some stuff, you know, you know, yeah. she's kind of tired of her content, okay? So then she rambles on, you know, rambles and rambles and rambles um, about how she's going to produce more interesting content, this, that, and the other. So then she is dressed, honey. She is dressed. She's putting her, her little items from her coach purse. She's putting it into her diaper bag. And then she's putting that joint on her shoulder. And she's like ready to go to the store. So boom, we in the car. We move. We going to the hair store and picking up some hair and some hair bows and some this, that, and the other. So, okay, we inside of the um the beauty supply store. Oh, excuse me, y'all. Beauty supply store. Okay. So while she's in there, she rambles on about hair bows and just i don't know she's picking up hair this that and the other it really doesn't matter to be honest with you but she did get the hair some hair balls boom so we back in the car and then she rambles on some more about her her eyebrows and how she can't find clear um hair bobos for the kids or whatnot and the grandmother has like a plug or whatever she knows where to get them Rambles and rambles and rambles and rambles some more. Okay, so boom. So now we are going to five below. And it's just her and Baby Legendary. And she is getting some headphone 
excuse me, some headphones, blooper, some headphones for the kids, okay? So she gets the headphones and we're back in the car. She rambles on some more about getting a nine to five job and how she has like anxiety about like going out with other people. She's trying to work on it and she would love to, you know, work, you know, a nine to five or whatever, or excuse me, um, a nine to whatever, because it ain't a nine to five, right? So it's a nine to whenever the kids get out because she wants to, you know, definitely work on her social skills and she wants to, you know, um, definitely integrate with the people and, and, you know, do all that, right? Okay, so I'm like, okay, girl. All right, boom. So now we back at the house. We back at the house. And she shows us like hair supplies and all the stuff she got from the beauty supply store. Okay, we don't care. So we move on. And then she rumbled some more about diapers and all this and the other. And but she does go ahead and get the kids um hair done because I believe Kaylin has a basketball game and Philip is picking up the kids. So she does their hair, it looks cute. And then basically, boom, we done. She says she wants to the store to get some diapers from H E B, like she always does. Boom, done. Overview completely done. All right. All right, y'all, so moving on that long. So I'm going to do the negatives first this time. So, boom, negative. My first negative, Um, <laughs> the, she said that she was tired, right? She's like, oh, my God, I'm so tired. My stomach hurts. But she flips her Apple Watch kind of up or whatever. She was, like, doing something with her hair or whatever. And it said it was 1040 a.m. So I'm like, girl, <laughs> girl. Are you really? I mean, it's it's basically like almost 11 o'clock. You tired? I mean, I get that. But you're tired every single video all of the time. So maybe you should get some iron pills or some energy supplements or talk to your doctor or something like that so that you can have some more energy. Because, I mean, I'm not going to lie. I am tired of her saying that she's tired. Like, girl, okay. Girl, we all tired. Like, girl, okay anyway moving on so the second negative so basically she says that you know the twins last day of daycare is on friday and you know she's sick of the daycare calling her about aiden needing to be picked up early um but <laughs> but she didn't say a plan for aiden she didn't say how she was going to correct the behavior she didn't say how she was going to address it I mean, she didn't say anything. So, Aiden was in daycare. He was acting up. Now he's going to go to school. And what is the plan? That would be beneficial um, to show what the plan is to get him ready for school, right? Because in a previous video, she said that she wanted to do things for the moms and she wanted to, you know, just educate the moms on how to handle this behavior. But we're not getting any education on how to handle, um, you know, poor behavior from daycare and then transitioning to school. We're not getting any of that. So that's definitely a negative for me. Okay, so my next negative, um, Aiden, <laughs> Aiden was in there like, mommy, you're so pretty, you're so pretty, and I was like, oh, that's super sweet, but I'm thinking like, mm, it sounds like either Aiden wants some attention that he's not getting, and that's why he's saying that, or it's some stuff going on in some conversations that's being had that he's privy to where somebody or she's made it seem like someone has said that she isn't pretty so it's kind of like he's saying it to overcompensate for whatever conversations that he's heard that was said that she wasn't pretty you know what i mean so it's giving me the children are in grown folks business that's the vibe it's giving me so I thought that was a negative just because I'm trying to, I'm I'm kind of, excuse me, I'm kind of peeping the scene. And it seems like there are some conversations that's being had, um, adult conversations where Aiden doesn't need to hear or any of the children. And he's just like, you know, telling her that, that she's pretty because he wants attention, one, or because he's heard that conversation 
that she's had where I'm sure she's probably complaining about people saying that she's ugly and this, that, and the other. And it's like, okay, Aiden doesn't need to be a part of that conversation, okay? Or any of the children. So, okay. I just thought that was interesting um, and definitely a negative. Moving on. All right, y'all. So, we're going to move on to some positives, okay? So, I thought that My Jazzy Life was really pretty in the clip um, where she was going out. She was out and about. Her um her little outfit was like, you know, it was it was cute or whatever. I thought that her hair was cute, her edges were laid, um, you know, eyelashes were 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 okay. Um, eyebrows definitely needed some work, but I think that overall she looked acceptable to go outside. She looked pretty, skin looks looked good or whatnot, right? So okay, she looks pretty. So um the second positive, um, I was happy to see that um, Philip, which is her ex boyfriend, the father of her four children, um, his mother, which is the kid's grandmother, definitely continues to help out in any way that she can. Um, so I think that's definitely a positive because there are, you know, there are people out here where women and men they don't get help from the other side of the family, okay. Um, so I think that's super positive. I think that Jazzy is super blessed to have a grandmother that wants to continuously be in the children's life. Not only be in the children's life, but actually, you know, helps out financially. So I think that's great, okay? Um, moving on. So my third positive, basically, she said that she is busting out more content, okay? She said she about to do some different stuff. She about to bring us something spicy, some spicy content, because she only have one child um, that's not going to be in school, which is Baby Legendary. She said, honey, if it's just going to be her and Baby Legendary, she is going to go out here and she's going to peruse these streets and peruse this world and give us some fly ass content okay so i was like okay that's so positive jesse okay let's do that let's see you doing that you know and i think that would help her mental state as well as her mood and her energy and all that so i think that was certainly a positive okay my last and final positive i think that the kids look super cute she did their hair you know she put it on all the girls hair into like little um little um what did she say puff balls edges were laid um it looked you know super cute they are always super super cute excited and happy they were going to um Caitlin's game looked really cute boom love it okay Aiden looked super cute as well even though he didn't get his hair done but he looked super super cute handsome should I say um and yeah so that was definitely a positive all right y'all so i have given y'all an overview some negative some positives to my jazzy life's video okay i hope that everyone is having a fantastic beautiful amazing terrific productive blessed day i hope that you all will like comment and subscribe to your girl nosy rosie's youtube channel i appreciate each and every one of y'all okay for checking out my video please subscribe please do that hit that little subscribe button y'all i appreciate y'all all right i am out of here i love y'all bye